Hello, today I am going to show you how to access O'Reilly for Public Libraries, formerly known as Safari Books Online. O'Reilly for Public Libraries offers unlimited access to over 50,000 titles on software, programming, and business, and over 30,000 hours of video. As you can see, we are currently on the sclibrary.org homepage, located at sclibrary.org. We are then going to go over to Books and More, and beneath the Research Tools subheading, select Databases by Subject. We are then going to click on Computers and Technology. We are then going to click the link for O'Reilly for Public Library. We are now going to be prompted to enter our username or barcode followed by our PIN number. We are then going to select Let's Go and got it. So as you can see, we are currently on the O'Reilly homepage. On the left hand side, we have our navigation bar featuring the home button featured, which allows us to navigate, change, recommended, as well as explore particular topics such as early releases, shared playlists, most popular titles, resource centers as well as Answers, Settings, Support, and Sign Out. The Answers tab is also highlighted in the center of the home page, where you are allowed to ask questions as well as explore commonly asked questions. As far as expert playlists, these are hand-picked content that are specific to certain subject areas. For example, we have Cloud Engineering Fundamentals, Python Powered Excel, SQL for Data Science, Advanced, and many more to browse through right here. Let's say we wanted to find materials on Excel. We are going to type that in to the search bar on the upper left hand corner and click enter. And as you can see, as far as results go, we get books as well as videos. Let's go ahead and select the book. And when on the web page for the record, you can see book description about the publisher. You also have the option of start reading now. If you scroll down, you can see the table of contents, which allows you to explore for specific areas of interest. Let's say you wanted to learn more about creating function procedures. Chapter five would give you information pertaining to that subject area. Let's say we wanted to explore the result that was a video. Okay, so as you can see, this result was a video. We are now going to click on that and wait for it to load. So as you can see, the setup for a video record is a little bit different. We can see the estimated time to complete, and we can also see the chapters which feature the times of the videos. And so you are able to explore this as well. And then you also have the option of starting from the very beginning by clicking start right here. And let's go back to the home page. So this has been a very brief overview of what O'Reilly has to offer. We encourage you to take the time to explore this resource. And if you have any questions, you are welcome to contact Santa Clara City Library staff.